We are going to check how to resolve this error message, failed to connect to the Rockstar Games Library Services. To fix this issue, we need to ensure that the Rockstar Games Library Service is running on our PC. First, let's click on the Windows icon located at the bottom left corner of your screen. Next, type Run and click on the Run app that appears. This will open the Run dialog box. Type services.sc and click OK. Now, in the Services dialog box, you should see a window displaying various services. Scroll down until you find Rockstar Games Library Services. Once you've located it, double-click on it to open the Properties window. In the Properties window, check the Startup Type field. It should currently be marked as Disabled, which means the Start option is grayed out and we cannot start the service. To change this, select Automatic from the drop-down menu in the Properties window. Once you've done that, click on the Apply button to save the changes. Now, you will notice that the Start option is no longer grayed out. You can now click on the Start button to initiate the service. Finally, click on the OK button to close the Properties window. Let's close the Services window. Now click on the Windows icon once again. Type System Configuration and select it from the search results. This will open the System Configuration window. Navigate to the Services tab. To make it easier to find the relevant service, put a check mark on the Hide All Microsoft Services option. Now, scroll down until you find Rockstar Games Library Services. Put a tick mark in the checkbox next to it and then click on the OK button. A prompt will appear asking you to restart your PC, but you can choose to exit without restarting at this moment. Instead, check if you are able to open the Rockstar Launcher. If the issue persists, you can proceed with restarting your PC and then see if the problem is resolved. If the issue still persists after the restart, Please try these four additional steps. Disable antivirus slash firewall on your PC and try opening the Rockstar Launcher again. If the Rockstar Launcher is installed on a drive other than the C drive, try uninstalling it and reinstalling it on the C drive and see if the issue is resolved. This may sound weird, but restarting your network router modem may resolve the issue sometimes. If none of the above steps have worked so far, consider performing a clean installation of the Rockstar Launcher. I will provide you the link in the description. I hope these steps help you resolve the issue you're facing. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more helpful tutorials.